Hi everyone, welcome. I'm going to share a channeling I got on the current situation in the world. Uh, I got this channeling when the uh, quarantine started. And I've been a bit resistant to making a video for quite some time, even though uh, my guides are pushing me to it. Uh, it's quite out of my comfort zone. So bear with me as I'm figuring this all out and please let me know if this resonates with you, how you think it is and I hope it can help you. So in the channeling I got they asked if we can love the consciousness of fear. Um, they say that the, the fear is almost like a blanket now covering the earth plane and it is a lot of people that are almost like blinded out of fear. So when you are really playing in that paradigm, in that consciousness, it is difficult to even think or like get connection with, with your own thoughts, see your own belief systems and, and kind of be able to step out in that more observer perspective. So what I said is that it's... Um, better if we can try to connect with our own fear uh, because it's rising to be cleared uh, and not fighting um, the fear. So if we instead can try to step into the vision of the fear being cleared, no matter whether we feel the fear ourselves or we are more in the space of observing how things are playing out in the world right now. Uh, and so uh, they showed me this as like almost like a ball uh, that is hard and cold, this fear, like it feels like a contraction in the body. And if we can love and embrace it rather than fight it, it will help melt, melt it down. And they ask us to be aware of how we can let the light enter. There's lots, lots of light coming in, high frequencies coming in, and also with our own awareness and how we play in this right now. And if we open up instead of closing down energetically, we help spreading the light and letting the light enter into this consciousness that is being cleared now. And that will help also clearing up the path for those that are out of sight. Um, and this goes also with uh, people, I mean, many people are in quarantine in their houses, maybe with other people that are experiencing this differently, that are playing more or playing less within the fear, that have different triggers coming up, Maybe some are completely calm, not triggered, but get triggered by others that are triggered or that are really playing in the fear of getting caught up in, in all the drama that is going on. So everyone will at some level be feeling this. And they said that if we try to not shut down to the others, but lovingly engage uh, with those that are around us that are in a lot of fear. Instead of judging it, making it wrong, seeing ourselves as better as or worse as if we are the one in fear and there are others that are not so much in fear. It is so easy now to get into that judgment and self-blaming and being even afraid of others' fear. So if we can just try to open up, to see it, to have compassion for it, at the same time as we hold our own feel, that you are aware of how you're feeling, if you have triggers, if you feel your own fear, let yourself feel it, be with it, and help it to clear. And if you are around people that are playing in this and you don't want to get drawn into it, of course have your own boundaries around it and 
and do what is right for you, but without judging the others. Because if we start fighting each other, it will only make it worse. And it's very difficult, they're saying, to clear thoughts and beliefs when, when we are caught up in that fear. So it's more difficult the more the more we are playing in it or the more we are feeling it it's more difficult to be able to be in that observer point and to become aware of our own thoughts and our beliefs um, and that we can help with so they showed me that we are very often seeing th this as stairs uh, about the consciousness, like a higher consciousness, a lower consciousness, we're better, worse than dark light, right? Everything is a duality. And if we can instead see a higher awareness or more um, evolved state in a way, instead of climbing stairs and then being either like looking up at someone and like, oh, I want to be there and probably they think I'm not evolved or I'm not seeing this or I don't know as much and I haven't realized these things or looking down at others like are you still playing in that are you still believing in that are you that we don't get anywhere with that way of thinking so they said that it would be better if we can start seeing this as consciousness that are being expanded that is like a light within that is getting bigger and bigger and bigger. The more awareness we get, the higher consciousness. And then we can also easily see how this light, the more it expands, that it can shine longer. Like we can we can reach others with it, we can help shining light on others path when they are out of sight as they are saying um, so even though it can be difficult at times try to hold compassion for others and they really ask us to hold compassion for everyone as the human are learning about a huge paradigm of fear now so I hope this was helpful for you. Take care of yourself. Let me know how you think this message was. And have a beautiful day.